Hello everyone, my name is... Nope, nope, we're gonna start again. I'm Brandon McInnes, and I am the voice of a sneaky, crafty, clever character you know as Gen in Dr. Stone. And I'm here today to enjoy some mystery ramen sent to me by Funimation and TMS Entertainment. I've never had anyone send me ramen before, so this is nice. I have three minutes while this steeps. Is it? It's not called steeping, is it? For ramen? Boil? While this reconstitutes? I don't know the word. <gasps> That was intense. Oh, I think it's spicy. Look at this tiny fork. Okay, here we go. What was the science project you were most proud of? What do you think Senku would say about it? Well, when I was in first or second grade, I did a science fair project on the different um, things in drinking water in different places. And so things like the pH and uh, how much copper was in there and magnesium and things like that. And uh, I just compared um, those levels from different places and they were all within the healthy range. Uh, so that was good. I feel like Senku would want me to do more with that, but uh, but yeah, okay. Without spoiling it for fans who haven't watched season two yet, how does season two differ from season one? You get a lot more character development and interaction between characters that you didn't get interaction between in season one. Are there any funny behind the scenes stories you can tell us about? Yes, yes I can. You know how Gen squeaks? You know that thing? That was very fun to be directed in because I gave a take and Cliff was like, no, you can give me more squeak than that. Give me more squeak than that, Brandon. And so I did and the Gen squeak was born. And uh, now when we do uh, recording together, yeah, we just squeak at each other randomly between takes. I feel very sorry for our engineer. So sorry. Uh, next, next. What character in Dr. Stone would you free from the stone first? Senku, obviously, because nothing could happen without Senku. There would be no Kingdom of si Senku. Senku. I would free Senku first. What fan comments about Dr. Stone were most memorable for you? Someone said Gen is my spirit animal and it made me think about like um, someone being really unhappy at a job they're at or like uh, unhappy in a relationship they're in and they're, they're like, oh, how do I break up? And Gen being on their shoulder being like, no, no, you're done. Uh-uh. You deserve better. Okay. What is your favorite part about Dr. Stone? I feel like the teamwork in Dr. Stone is wonderful because everyone plays to their strengths. You know, like Gen is isn't a scientist, but he's uh, he's a good people person. I mean, you know, okay, he's good at manipulating people, but he also has very high a very high like emotional quotient. He, he understands people, and he can kind of like figure them out. And I feel like that's a good asset for the. Oh, we're done. That's so fast. Moment of truth, everyone. Tiny fork, itty bitty fork. It smells so good. It's been so long since I've had ramen. I don't want to spill this all over my desk, but look, look at all the little bits and bobs. All right, there's like little mushrooms there. Okay, here we go. Ah, oh, it's so hot, it's burning my fingers! Ah! Ah! Yeah. Oh. Mm. Okay. oh, it's so hot! Mm. It's spicy! Oh. Mm. I messed up! I didn't bring any water! Ah. Oh, so spicy! It's, why is it spicy? Why is it so spicy? I can do this! I can do this again on my shoulder! Oh, you can do that, it's just spice! Suck it up, you're from Texas! Ah! In my face! Oh gosh! This is really good. This is really good. What is... I don't know. Well, it's not seafood. I don't think it's chicken. Is it other pork or beef, maybe? Maybe beef? Perhaps? I don't know. I'm really bad at guessing ramen flavors. But it's delicious. Oh, it's beef. It's beef. It is beef. Yay! All right, well, I'm Brandon McInnes, um, voice again in Dr. Stone, and thank you for joining me for this mystery ramen adventure. Thank you, Funimation and TMS Entertainment, for sending me this delicious ramen. Don't forget to check out season two of Dr. Stone, and also don't forget to like and subscribe to Funimation for more of that good, good anime goodness and more wholesome content like this. Have a good one. I'll talk to you later. Bye! Oh, so hot.